needed. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Aaron. And you too, Mavda. Oh, this is wonderful. I can go back to my village. Don't get too far ahead of yourself, young lady. The curse is far from being lifted. Huh? There, on your back. <sighs> Not so long as that mark remains. hasn't been lifted. What do you mean? But I'm normal again. Only for a while. So long as you have that on your back, the curse will slowly take hold. You mean... the meat? I can't stomach any more. Well, I'm afraid you're going to have to. Otherwise, things are only going to get worse. <laughs> Do you think the maiden at the harvest festival would end up forced to eat meat? Why, that's because of the curse, of course. Why, indeed. <laughs> How would I know? Why, yes. Poor Elena is not the first to be cursed in this way. All sorts of things. Some fell into the hands of the Illyrian army and were dealt with. All you have to do is to keep bringing beast flesh back from the towers. Though that will only weaken the curse, it won't hold it back forever. When Elena consumes the flesh, her changes will reverse. But if you leave her as she is, the poor girl's transformation will continue unabated. If you can't slow the curse's progress, she will never be human again. You've got a memory like a sieve. My name's Mavda, and don't you forget it. I told you this already. My people are the Vestra, and we are traveling merchants. You forgot already? Deary me, I introduced you. This old fellow is my boon companion. He's rather shy and retiring, I'm afraid. Oi, you up there. That's right, isn't it? <sighs> so this is to be my life? To be cooped up in here, eating foul flesh? Must I learn to live like this? Can I not lift the curse? Lifting the curse, you say? Well, now. Oh, do tell me, Mavda, please! Aaron, you must head back to the towers. Deep within each one, a master awaits you. Defeat these masters and return here with their flesh. If Elena eats this flesh, the mark on her back will fade, and she may be human once more. No! I won't hear of it! How can I ask Aaron to face such dangers for my sake? <laughs> of course. That's easier said than done. Oh, that reminds me. I have a little something for you.
This belongs to my people. It's called the Oraklas Chain. And now to take just a little of Elena's lovely hair. What? It's for Aaron's sake. <laughs> I take it this is your first time. Quite a sight, is it not? My people, the Vestra, are the heirs to a special power. We can control the chains of destiny, the invisible ties that bind people together. Aaron, hold out your hands. Oh. It seems you know what you're doing, so I will entrust this to you. Now, wherever you go, you will always be connected to Elena. Day, wasn't it? I'm still a bit dazed, but I think I'm all right. Thanks for worrying about me. Eating the monster flesh is the only way I can stay human. I have to eat Master Flash in order to lift the curse. But it's so dangerous for you, Aaron. Don't give me a reason to worry, will you? The thought of something happening to you. Is everything all right? Yes, Aaron? at home. You'll be here for a while. You can't afford to wander too far. The army will be looking for you. Without doubt. But you're safe here. This was the observatory the Illyrian army used to keep an eye on the Thirteen Towers. But no one uses it anymore. I doubt they look here. Quick on the uptake, aren't you? Well, that's how things stand. <laughs> so it's time to open for business. The treetop tower was once used to grow plants for food. The followers of the Way of Ios eat no meat, so it must have been an important place. It's a fine irony that you've ended up going there in search of beast blood, is it not? <laughs> 
Was there something else you wanted? The treetop tower, the follow it's of <laughs> Was there something? If you've got hunks of flesh you don't need, I'll gladly take them off your hands. You want to know what I'll do with it? Let's just say there's a market for all sorts of things. <laughs> oh, and there's one more thing I should mention. Monster flesh is still just raw meat, so it will go off. I'm afraid I can't give you a good price for rotting meat. Before rushing off to another tower, come and see me with any flesh you might have. <laughs> Was this? It may not be my place to say this, but be good to Elena. Talking to her is all well and good, but you can also give her gifts from time to time. There's no sense in making things any harder for the poor girl than they already are. <laughs> What's that? If you've got any spare items, bring them to us. He'll combine them with other items and make something new for you. <laughs> and it won't cost you a thing. We enjoy seeing strange and wonderful items. Was there something else you... If you want to enhance your... <laughs> Was there something else you wanted? Choose a weapon to forge. Choose a way to forge. Was there something else you... Select the item you wish to create. Was there something else? Select the materials you want to combine. Was there something else you wanted? Here's what's in stock today. cost you this much. Was there something else you wanted? Oh, be sure to take this with you. You don't need to give me anything in return. We help each other out, you see. Farewell for now. Hearing that kind of thing is bound to put anyone on edge. right away. Let's hope we get some pretty flowers soon. What's up?
See what it looks like when it's lit. It's such a warm light, don't you think? Huh? <clears throat> Thank you. This will add some cheer to the evenings. <laughs> 